What's up everybody, it's Chris coming to you with another one of my crazy crossroads, Big Joey C, Urban Ghost, Urban Explorations. Video two tonight, we did the uh, Poltergeist trailer. We used the new app that Joe purchased, um, uh, Necrophonic. That yes. um, <laughs> freaked me the hell out, regardless of whether it's really happening or not. Um, it, it definitely uh, struck a nerve with me so we're at the um, abandoned funeral parlor that I have yet to film at um, I did come out here for a 30 minute loan challenge and I had a bad vibe and didn't shoot it and that must have been months ago so uh, Joe and I are here we're gonna do this uh, app again and see what we can get uh, you may be seeing this in the same video uh, probably not I'll probably gonna do two because we did almost 30 minutes in the first one like I said I don't We'll see what happens here. If this is real short, then we'll, uh, we'll this will be one. But if not, hey, whatever. We'll see you guys on the outside. Deuces. Okay, so like I said, this is the first time I'm rolling film here. I've been here, I've walked through it. Um, basically, it's an abandoned funeral parlor. Um, there is no access to the inside. Um, we're definitely not going to uh, break in and trespass. Um, but on the outside, there are the abandoned vehicles and uh, some crazy activity was back here when uh, Joe was out here. Um, so, here we are. <clears throat> yeah, Joe's talking about how he had something knock on him here at the store. But this entrance is just so creepy. What I imagine was this was probably where they would roll. Um, roll the um, bodies out. And start the procession uh, from here. Um, so this is the back of the actual building. But it's just kind of creepy. <clears throat> so there's an old, like, one of those storage bins out back here. And then door is actually really creepy too so so I have to be honest that necrophonic app definitely freaked me out <clears throat> now I think when I came, originally there was a car over here. There's one back there, but I thought there was another one up here. Hey, Joe. So I came back here and completely uh, decided against this place. <clears throat> say that there was 
a couple of other cars here. Wasn't there somebody here when you were here, Joe? I think so. Yeah, there's evidence that somebody's in the back. Oh, yeah. So it's a little bit of a homeless uh, hangout. Yeah. Uh, we'll see. <clears throat> Anybody back here? Hello? What's that? Is his children's toys? Yeah, little kids' toys. This is creepy. Really sad to think that somebody would have been residing back here, man. That's really terrible. Of course, somebody came back here and stripped the AC unit. There's a pillow, and some kids' toys. Oh, that's so Just sad. Just so you guys know, we do have water and food in the car. If there is anybody that we run into, we're always here to help out. We're not really here to disturb anybody. Nah, it's so heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking as can be. <clears throat> oh, okay, see there's a little There's a convenience store Right here And you can see There's a fence But that middle of the fence there is cut out so that's probably their access point they probably would go from here over to the convenience store kind of wash up get some snacks so it's kind of an ideal location but it's just uh, just such a sad sad spot <clears throat> Bug spray. What do you suppose a little black thing is on the ground there? Is that a little transformer battery pack or something? Looks like it. You know what's weird? There's a console to a car back here. Right there. Yeah. Center console. They must have been keeping stuff in there. Yep. <clears throat> See that right breaks my heart to see that especially when you see remnants of children yeah gosh it's so so terrible so sad hey joe um when i walked here when i walked through here the first time i came uh -huh. <clears throat> i think there was another car over here and wasn't was there another car there too so there was a car on the other side of this back right there. Right there, and then on this side of the storage. Yeah, and that one's gone now. It's like a cutlass, a brown cutlass or something. Yes, one was here, something, or somebody in the top of the truck. You hear that? Uh, needles in this car. There are. Or a needle. Oh, uh, there's good people back here shooting yeah. that bad. Looks like a bottle of urine. urine. And hypodermic needles. Wow. You know, last time I was here, man, there was some <coughs> dolls in here and they're gone. There was like a couple of like baby dolls, like a kid's toy. Yeah. And some Sudoku puzzles. Yeah. Uh, so there, there is evidence that people can buy. Syringes, bottles of urine, and homeless go hand in hand. Oh, here's another needle on the floor here. Be so let's just be step. real careful. I mean, we got our boots on, so. Yeah. Mm. 
Bummer. What a bummer. Okay. Let's do this show. Yeah, we're gonna do this. Alright guys, so we're having a blast tonight. This is so much fun. Yeah, this is a great night. The best part of doing this video is, of course, is we always have a laugh and, and we make it kind of amusing. We're gonna try the app again tonight. And uh it's creepy back here as can be. Uh, the first time I was here, it was definitely a setup by this person. Now it's it's still creepy, but we don't have to worry about that problem anymore. And okay, we're gonna try the app. This is the uh, Necrophonic app. Let's see if we pick up anything. Let's see if we can solve a mystery of this place. Maybe, just maybe, this is legit. I'm gonna we'll pull see. out the app now. We're gonna start it up. Maybe it's not. But again, I'll let you guys decide on that. I'm not an expert on this, but it sure is fun to see. One this of the place is looking for very, is, very, very, very creepy, by the way. It is very creepy. Back because there. just to know that they, that it was a funeral home where they've done probably uh, cremations and, and yeah. bombings. And <laughs> it, you know, that just, that's just freaky. It's freaky that it's, it's a funeral freaky. home. It's freaky that there's cars behind the funeral home. Yeah, it doesn't make really much sense. Yeah. On how this whole thing is it doesn't make any sense at all. Taking place, yeah. but nevertheless. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna stop this now. So this is the Necrophonic app. If you already seen it if, in the, the Poltergeist video, uh, trailer video, this is this is the app we're gonna use. Let's see if we pick up anything. The names we're looking for is Samantha. We're looking for the name Bobby, and we're looking if we could. <laughs> what the. It could be from, from there, though. Maybe. All right, guys, let's do this. I'm going to start this off now. Apparently, you, you hit start. You have an option start, white noise, echo. Get rid of the reverb. Let's do this. So in, let us know what you might hear. Please. Doug. I don't know. Let's do it. I'm going to shut my light off and just work off of... Oh. Let's see if we go to a place a little more quiet, do you think? Let's see, maybe over here, because you're getting a little bit of light on. I don't remember the little bench being here. Alright, can you tell us the mystery of this place? Two guys, two guys. I think so. Oh boy. Can we say the names that we're looking for? What I've what I've noticed that I Sounded like it said echo. No case, no case. Here we go. Road? This thing really freaks me out. So this is... 
What the fuck Bobby, is that? Bobby, Bobby. So what I've noticed is it's completely different. Who right? threw the rock through the window of this truck? Joe. I thought he said Joe. Who threw the rock at me? I wonder if we bring this by the door. Let's go over there. We're getting a lot of, again, a lot of road noise, guys. Sorry about that. There is a convenience store next door. So, definitely, definitely, definitely um, a different sequence and different noises. It's not as, right. it's not the same sound. So, I don't know. I would think if it's an app and it's just. So those people next to if it's just doing specific noises over and over again, it seems like it's different. So, we're going to set up over here by this uh, creepy door to see what we can get. Yeah, that definitely uh, seems different, right? Yeah, it seems pretty cool. I'm just gonna get this app up again. Alright. Keep saying Joe. Say our names again. Be free. 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 Nick. Joe, Joe. Stop, stop, stop. Joe, why do you keep saying Joe? Can you say my name? I always say bro too, it's from Joe, bro. Keith. What was, what's Jim's real name? We'll know that. Well, maybe if he says it, that'd be nice though. Bobby, Bobby. Mike. Why are you, why are you saying random names? Can you tell us something specific? Like a Tourette's. <laughs> in the book, in the book. In the book, in the book. Can you tell us? 
the names that we seek. Did they be in English class? See, the thing about it, guys, it's hard to tell what's around us with this thing on, but at the same time, there's a, there's a gas station over there. Yeah. MC Hammer, MC Hammer. <laughs> <laughs> MC Hammer lives here. That, that, Can you say my name? Say my name. Are we safe here? So over here, there was another car, right? Yeah. And then there's one behind that. All right, so thus far... The tree there. <clears throat> didn't hear mine. Definitely sounds like I heard Joe several times, but... I don't believe I heard... Uh, I didn't hear my name at all. Like we did on the last one. But... Regardless, it's kind of cool. It's different. I like the thing. Yeah, so there was a car right here, and then there was another car in this area here, too. I feel... Oh. I feel a little better in this, in this location than I did in the trailer, that's for sure. Just because so much has happened in that trailer, too, so... That always stays in the back of your head. This place is definitely, definitely creepy. Just hanging out here. Yeah, somebody's over there. Let's get let's get out of here. No, it's just a worker.
But yeah, there's some people back here, so we're gonna cut out. I'm gonna cut out anyway. All right, so here's the deal. There's a uh, there's sort of like a storage facility back here, and then in the front of it, there's a pizza place. And the gentleman that owns the pizza place was was watching. He said he saw the lights and everything because our lights are so bright. But here's the deal. Um, they found a homeless person um, that was beaten to death. Did he say he was beaten to death or? So there was a homeless person that was apparently beaten to death and they're trying to find out who killed him or whatever the story was. Um, <clears throat> so he just said there's cops are through here all the time. So we don't want to alarm anybody. So we went over and spoke with them. Everything's cool on our end. <laughs> but anytime, uh, anytime there's a person that's sitting there watching us, we need to kind of investigate that as well. And just to make them feel comfortable that we're not doing anything to harm anybody or whatever but definitely uh definitely a sad 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 situation so um anyway i just wanted to come back uh sign off properly guys thank you so much this has been su such a fun night uh tonight with joe and i um i hope you guys are enjoying the, the video with the um with the phone app uh, it's kind of crazy this wasn't so nutty um didn't freak me out as much as it did in the trailer so it seemed like in the trailer they were possibly answering some of the questions that we were asking um here it was just a lot of random voices so who knows we'll see guys please uh see the descriptions down below uh make sure you like share subscribe all that good stuff i appreciate you guys so much um i would love to get to uh hundred thousand subscribers by this time next year so i can't do it without you guys helping me out so please share and uh we'll see you next time deuces